Welcome. Would, may I introduce you, her? Pl please. Yeah, Would Pam, please? my cousin Pam has been on here before, and she. this is Pam Fortner, and who's still kind of new to Arkansas. Well, you guys lived here about three years now? Five. You've been here five years yes. already? Holy cow, yes. time does go by. Mm -hmm. But anyway, you are here to talk about the Marion County Tour of Homes. That's right. Which is to benefit what first? It benefits the uh, Single Parent Scholarship Fund of Marion County. Of Marion County, mm -hmm. okay, because yes. that's good. And this is our single, the only thing we do all year for a fundraiser. This is it. Okay. And uh, we just do it the first Sunday of every December. And uh, this year we're thrilled because we have Cedarwood Lodge on the tour. Now, where Which is, is that at? It is, <coughs> if, um, it's in Ray Valley. Uh -huh. And a lot of people know when you say Ranchette area, they'll kind yeah, of know where that is. Yeah. And so uh, Cedarwood Lodge is on it, and two homes just down from Cedarwood Lodge, all on White River. So we're calling it the White River Tour. Oh, how nice. Okay. And then uh, another lady called me, and she said, oh, I'd just love to be on the tour. And so, you know, usually you don't get that. Yeah, usually it's like, like, i got to find somebody. Yeah. <laughs> yeah. <laughs> it's usually more difficult than that. So we have the, the lodge and three other homes. Oh, are year. they all so in that same basic area, though? Basic area. They are in uh, 0.7 miles of each other. And if it's a beautiful December <coughs> day, we'll be able to, you could, if you wanted to, you could actually walk between the homes. And this is totally new. Mm -hmm. Usually they're spread out all over the county. Yeah. But this year, they're just right there, and the uh, lodge is going to be our hospitality center. Okay. Mm -hmm. So that's where the food is going to be, and also we have a lady named Kathy Butler, who recently married, so she's uh, Kathy Butler Bebout, mm -hmm. <laughs> and she has her string students there. And they play, they're going to play in the loft area mm. of the Cedarwood Lodge, Christmas carols. Mm -hmm. And so uh, I, I just think it would be beautiful to have the music just... Drifting, I mean, yes, down, drifting yeah. down in in the lodge, and that'll be very nice. The cabins are on the uh, the tour also. Now, now can you get a, a map somewhere? Well, you what, you do, anything, what you do when you buy your ticket? Okay, the directions are all on the back. Oh, all right. So that's that's how that works. Define. Where yes. can you buy a ticket? Right now at the Chamber of Commerce in Yellville. All right. That's where they are right now, and then of course any board member of Single Parent Scholarship Fund, but. Uh, basically, right now, it's in, at the Yellville Chamber. Which is up at the Old Depot, at the yes. top of the hill. Yes, okay. that's it. And then also, on the day of, mm -hmm. because it is a Sunday, we're going to be selling tickets in town at Yellville at the Red Raven, which I'm sure everybody knows everybody where knows. that is, right across mm -hmm. from Fred's mm -hmm. and everything. Uh, we will be selling the tickets there. And then it's about a 20-minute drive. But once you get there, you're there. That's what I'm trying to push. You know, it, I know it's a drive. But it is beautiful out there. We're going to have a really good time. All the houses are decorated for Christmas. Uh, and tickets are $7 each. That's what they are. And uh, we're just looking forward to a really good time. And the other homes, uh, the first home, the Sorensen home, has three levels. And the bottom level is a basement that they've made into kind of like a man cave. You walk down, it's the pool table, and the NASCAR is the light. And, oh um, dear! Don't let a Jack bar see it. Oh, oh, I know, I know. <laughs> now, is this going inter to interfere with any man cave activities during oh, that time? I hope not. Like a football no. game? Yeah. Oh, we'll probably have the TV on. <laughs> yeah. 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 They'll be that's down there true. demonstrating uh -huh. the man cave activities. That's true. That's true. And uh, when's this going to be? Uh, December fourth. December fourth. One thirty to four thirty. And that's what? What, what is that? A, Sunday. A Sunday. Sunday yeah. afternoon. Mm -hmm. Yeah, they've done that for uh, 15 years now. I guess mm -hmm. it's been on Sunday afternoon. It's our 15th mm -hmm. annual. And also besides the Sorensen, then you've got the Cedar Lodge and uh -huh. the Sorensen. And then Sorensen's house. And then there's uh, another lady named Chris Sands mm -hmm. who has a nice cabin that she has just built. This isn't your normal rustic cabin, mm -hmm. but a beautiful cabin that she has. And uh, she's got just a, a beautiful sense of decorating and, and uh, she's going to do it up really nice for us mm -hmm. and then uh, the third home the other home is um, the Principados and they are a young couple who have two little boys so this is our uh, house with kids yeah. mm -hmm. <laughs> so uh, and she's really she's the one that was so excited about having us there and she said she's going to dress up the kids and I and know. Uh, you know all that sort of thing and maybe even my husband she said and he just oh <laughs> <laughs> yeah, he probably thought, no, I'll go to the yeah. man cave down yeah, there. Yeah, yeah, you know, exactly. oh, yeah, I'll go back to the man cave. Yeah. But anyway, it, it's going to be a nice tour this year. Well, it takes special people to open their homes up. It like does. This. Yeah. It does. It really does. A lot of people are, you know, a little 
a little nervous. Fearful of decorating. It's a lot of work. Mm -hmm. Yes, it is. It is it's a, a lot, lot of Because people decorate their bathrooms. I mean, they'll have, uh -huh. they'll have like four and five trees put up in the house. Uh -huh. and wow. <laughs> yeah. Yeah. yeah, they really go a whole lot. That's yeah, kind of all I can do to get, get a tree up. Uh -huh. so. <laughs> and hopefully it's good weather because you don't want yes. people in and out of your house if it's bad yeah, weather. That's yeah, that's right. Yeah. We always pray for good weather. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And uh, the other thing I did want to say today is that this is Single Parent Scholarship mm -hmm. Fund. And what we do is we try to help people, male or female, who want to go back to school and uh, accomplish something greater than what they're doing right now, you know, be able to lift themselves up a little bit with their education. And what we provide the scholarship money for is not normally what people think of when they think of scholarship money for tuition or books or whatever. Mm -hmm. But what we do is we give them the money to pay their energy bill, their gas bill to get back and forth um, to school, a child care bill, mm -hmm. At, uh, something like that. Yeah, maybe get a new battery for their car so they can yeah. get back and forth to school, you know, some things like yeah, that. Sometimes right. it's just getting your car and working yeah. more that you can drive back and forth or new tires for your car. Yeah, that's like right. That. You know, we've just learned that there are some basic needs that mm -hmm. need to be taken care of. And this is how we help the students. And uh, they have, one of our students just has a, like, a baby that's just a few months old. Mm -hmm. Another student has one that's just a few weeks old. And, and then another student who is a 4.0, by mm -hmm. the way, GPA, has a, a teenage son. Yeah. So it, we run the, the full gamut of it, and they're, they're just trying to do everything to do better. Mm -hmm. And we're just trying to help them a little bit to get better. And, and by the way, uh, Single Parent Scholarship Fund is in 70 counties now mm -hmm. in the state of Arkansas. So it's growing and, and doing very well. Yeah, I've had a lot of recipients mm -hmm. in my class. So it's the Marion County Tour of Homes. Yes. Mm -hmm. They're all close together. Yes. Pick your map up at the Red Raven uh -huh, on Sunday. Uh -huh. Starts at 1 to 4.30. 1.30 to 4.30. 1.30 yeah. to 4.30. Mm -hmm. December 4th. Okay, lots of fun. And price mm -hmm. of tickets? $7. $7. $7. You're not mm -hmm. paying attention. Wow. Well, $7. I didn't hear that before. I was expecting a lot more. I thought you were a good listener. I am a good listener. <laughs> okay. But that, that fact just kind of didn't get to my whatever part of the brain uh -huh, that, that uh -huh. makes me understand. You were so fascinated with what I was saying. That's I right. was. Mm -hmm. He's intimidated by women. It was all I could do oh. just to be this close. Oh, yeah. Well, that was it. Isn't that right, Daniel? <laughs> I hate it when the audience is full of women. Full of women. I, he just I hates it. I don't have a it. chance. <laughs> I know. Okay. Well, thanks so much for being here, Pam. Oh, thank you for having me. And, I appreciate uh, it. tickets are available. Yes. Uh, at the at chamber. The at the chamber right, right now. Mm -hmm. Mm -hmm. And where's it at? It's at the, the, the depot at the top of the hill. Oh, that works out. Oh, yeah, it's at the depot at the top yeah, of the hill. I pass that every time I come through here. I know, uh -huh. and Yellville, is, their chamber's very easy to find. Uh -huh. They're still working on that, too. Yes, they yeah, are. I, I, it is beautiful in there. Yeah. Yeah. Just beautiful. I'll just, just stop, stop by one of mm -hmm. these days. Yes, and Carolyn, the lady who works in there, yeah. a very gracious lady. Mm -hmm. She yeah, will she sell you all the tickets else. you want. Yeah, she'll sell you all the tickets and all that kind of good stuff. Yeah. All right, thanks, Pam. That's true. Thank you very much. All right, up next we have Deborah Osborne and Brooke Sutton and to be a Santa to a Senior program. Stay with us.